yeah, we're good to go. Oh, <laughs> big adventures. Right, how do I get on this thing? Oh, <laughs> just like that. Oh yeah, I can live with that. Hey yo, welcome back to the channel and thanks for tuning in. Got a fun little video for you this time around. Uh, my partner and I took a nice big trip over to the west coast of the South Island of New Zealand a few weeks ago. It was our first big moto adventure together. Uh, my partner's first big ride actually, so um, we were kind of excited about it and uh, we had an amazing time. It was incredible. The west coast is stunning. Roads are amazing. The scenery is incredible and the weather was perfect along the way. We had I think uh, four or five nights uh, camping at different campsites along the west coast and um, explored some of the most amazing roads and scenery anywhere in uh, New Zealand I believe. So yeah, come on, check it out and Join us for the ride. So I started recording around about Springfield. Uh, Springfield's a little town on the way up through Arthur's Pass over to the west coast. And uh, I, unfortunately, my uh, GoPro battery died just as we hit Jackson's heading over the west coast. Um, so a bit of a short clip this time. I hope you'll enjoy it. Thanks. Sorry, mate, got no room for you. Look for up. So, hey, welcome to this week's show, episode, whatever. Liv and I are heading up over the pass here. Uh, we're heading over to the west coast of the South Island of New Zealand. Got an absolutely glorious day weather-wise. Our bikes are running just sweet. Got them all loaded up. Uh, we've done uh, about 100 k's so far. And everything seems to be just groovy. Oh, we got a, uh, got very lucky today. The weather gods have, uh, have smiled upon us. We've got a fantastic day to cross uh, Arthur's Pass. Almost no wind. Very few clouds and uh, very little traffic because uh, we're heading to the west coast where everyone is uh, heading away from the west coast currently. Um, the Burt Monroe Challenge is on down in Southland and uh, we decided not to go uh, just because we wanted a holiday. Um, the weather's uh, not too favourable down south this week. Uh, it's going to be a few clear days on the weekend, but every other day around it's just raining, um, and we want to camp. Um, this is our first time motor camping, and we're just super excited and just hoping for fantastic weather, which, by the looks of it, we're actually going to get. So, very happy about that. Wow, it looks uh, like something out of a post-apocalyptic movie around here. A desolate landscape where once men roamed. <laughs> yeah, so we just uh, just cruise past Castle Hill now, uh, making our way towards Arthur's Pass Village. We're just uh, cruising along. Lives um, struggling a little bit, I feel, just with the wind in the hills and with the bike. The way it is, I don't know, she's not quite used to it. it. Does take a bit of getting used to, of course. Uh, but she's doing great. Is, you know, there's barely any traffic 
at all. So we can just uh, roll along at our pace. So there's, this is part of the Southern Alps here, that which makes up the backbone of New Zealand. And we're going to be going over through Arthur's Pass. Uh, and when we come back, we'll be coming back through the Lewis Pass. Of course, we've seen a lot of riders out. We're all heading to the Burt Munro. Ride safe, everyone. Off we go! Alright, just leaving Arthur's Pass Village. And it looks like we're going to get a, a sprinkling of rain going up through the pass. be expected. We'll just take it easy. Uh, it's only a light dusting. Or maybe not. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, we should have got rain gear. Oh, it's not too bad down the other side, but it looks a bit. Definitely a little bit cool around here, yeah, by uh, a couple of degrees or more. Oh, I forgot I was still recording. <laughs> wow. Um, yeah, so welcome to the West Coast. <laughs> oh, at least it's not raining now. I love it through here. Oh. Here, let me uh, clean off the lens so you guys can see. <laughs> this is so cool, this, I love this. We had um, just really a couple of spots of rain so far coming up through the pass and we're, we're over the other side now so we should be pretty clear from here oh yeah come on sunshine <laughs> yeah warm our bones dry our clothes give us vitamin D Oh yeah, we got some blue skies up ahead there. Oh, very nice. Oh, this is beautiful through here. This is definitely the furthest I've ever been. Um, yeah, okay, mate. Uh, that's a double line. Uh, yeah. Good job, pal. Fuck it out. <laughs> a few moments later. Oh, here he goes again. Oh, good job, buddy. Yeah, you go. <laughs> this is Jackson's. Ah. How you doing everyone? Um, yeah, made it to Hokitika. Uh, we're at our campsite. Lovely little place called uh, Link Views in um, Hokitika. We're just outside of Hokitika, heading towards Haast. Um, absolutely beautiful little campsite. Uh, we just 
kind of booked this place last minute. Um, went, yep, sure, this looks pretty cool. So, um, they have great little tent sites, they have powered sites, quite a small little campsite, but that's what we're after, just something quiet. Um, so, I'll put links down below for uh, link views, check it out. And, um, yeah, we're just here enjoying the first couple of beers. Um, we're going to chill out for the night. Just had the uh, our first uh, camp out meal, which was uh, Veggie Delight Burgers. Um, there's a barbecue provided here. Uh, sorry about all the wind noises. Uh, it's actually kind of windy around here. Um, a lot of wind blowing in off the ocean, I guess. Uh, well, the Tasman Sea, sorry, not the ocean. Um, but fantastic. Um, the ride over today was, was great. We had an absolutely amazing time. Um, Liv's biggest trip so far, uh, 245 kilometers. And we left town just about lunchtime and made it here about five o'clock. So really good going. Um, Liv is just doing so well with her acquiring. Um, first time with the bike loaded up with a whole heap of gear. And uh, look, she just did fantastic. Uh, the most cranky performed absolutely beautifully, just hummed along. Wouldn't have even known that it had an extra 45 kilos of weight on the back. Um, it just seemed to love every moment of it. So, um, as a touring bike, I can actually recommend it now. Um, very comfortable, absolutely very comfortable riding position. Um, it was actually good having that back support there the whole time I was riding. I, I did enjoy that. So. Um, yeah, from here we're gonna check out Hokitika tomorrow. Pretty good to Bullet Gorge. We may stay here another night yet. Um, it seems like a pretty cool place. And then uh, we'll continue up the west coast towards Westport and uh, Ranunga over the next couple of days. Uh, not Ranunga, sorry, Granity. Uh, we've got a couple of nights booked at a place called uh, Gentle Annie's. It's supposed to be quite the uh, place to stay. Um, hopefully we've got some good weather coming and um, yeah, we'll see you all soon. So, hope you're all having an amazing time wherever you are, to all my friends and uh, fellow riders at Bert Munner. I hope you're all staying safe and enjoying and staying dry. Um, and I'm pretty sure the weather gods have uh, smiled upon you at least for a couple of days of that racing. So, um, see you all when you get back. Peace.